I'm back with an update on an issue that has been going on for some time where your volume turns down on your iPhone automatically to protect your ears. You may receive notifications when this happens. The notification would say volume turned down. Based on your headphone usage over the last seven days, the volume has been turned down to protect your hearing. What we're going to do in this video is trick Apple and make them not do this. <laughs> That's the trick, and we're going to go into this and get this fixed so you can listen to music at the regular volume without it turning down. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin with HelpfulTutorials.net. If you like iPhone tips, tricks, and fixes, do me a favor, smack that subscribe button. We would love to have you join. We're getting so close to 10,000, and I'm very excited about that. Thank you. With that said, let's go ahead and dive right in. I know how it can get if people keep talking and don't get into the fix. So let's get this fixed for you. Here we are on my phone. And what we're going to do first is go ahead and tap on settings. When we tap on settings, we're going to go to a different place. Now you may have seen my other video. I'm going to go ahead and link it up top just so you have that for a reference. In case this doesn't completely work for you, you have another place to go. I'll also put it at the end of this video but I'm pretty sure this is going to take care of it. So what we would do is go into Bluetooth and we're going to see my car there. So we're going to go ahead and select that before I go any further though. I just want to say, make sure you watch to the end of this video because there is more steps. So with that said, let's go ahead and click on the eye. And what we're looking for here is device type. So let's go ahead and tap on device type. In here, you may see whatever's being turned down. For example, it may be for you, it might have been a speaker and it may say that it's headphones here. If you have headphones selected, it's going to go ahead and try to protect your ears by lowering the volume because that's what it does. Because the headphones are so close to your ears, it wants to protect you and not have it very loud. But now if you choose speaker, it's going to think the speaker could be across the room. So the volume's not going to be as important to lower. It may still do it, but I highly doubt it. What I would do is go ahead and choose speaker here. Now for car stereo, that's probably fine as well. Car stereo and speaker are probably the same profiles, but like I said, headphones are not going to be because headphones are going to be the one. So what would you do here? So basically, let's run down like this is your phone instead of my rogue it'll say uh, my headphones okay and you would choose this and then we go in device type and it's probably set like this so it's already set as headphones but that's why it's protecting you so if you trick it and you choose speaker now the iphone thinks your headphones are actually speakers so you can go out and out again and then it should stop it from lowering the volume. Now, like I said, wait till the end, but keep in mind, this could cause future issues with audio quality if Apple starts targeting each of those areas differently. I don't think they do at this time, but they may in the future. So just kind of keep that in mind. But I mean, it won't be lowering your volume. So how are we getting these options? What you need to do is go into general go under software update and pull down and make sure you update to iOS 14.4. This just came out yesterday and I wanted to give this a little testing before I got this video up. I didn't want to rush into it. We were unable to go ahead and get the volume to go down while using speaker. So I believe this is taken care of. We're going to continue testing this. And if we find anything that contradicts this, we will put it in the comments in a pinned comment. Also, if you find anything, please do as well. Like I said, this is still fresh. If this works for you, also please hit the like just so we know and we can gauge it. So that's how you trick it. You don't have to go through all the notifications and everything like that. You should just be able to switch the profile to one that's not using the notifications and then you should be all set. If you do not have 14.4, you will need to download it. So just go ahead and download and install the update as usual. If you need any help with that, I have a video on that as well. And then you should be all set. Any questions, please leave them below. This video did very well, the original. So I'm going to be monitoring this and 
if there's still any problems, we will get it fixed. Thank you so much for the view.